Also tonight, it's back to school tomorrow for Heritage High School in Newport News. And their school will look a lot different than how they left it. The last time they were all there together was September 20th, the day that a student shot two classmates. Come tomorrow, they'll walk into what school officials say is a much more secure place to learn. Ten on your side, Asia Tolliver has more tonight from Newport News. As students prepare to enter the doors of Heritage High School for the first time since last month's school shooting, school administrators are hoping to calm their nerves. On September 20th, two 17 year old students were shot when a 15 year old boy allegedly opened fire in a hallway after getting into a fight with one of his victims. Since the shooting, Newport News school administrators have taken steps to help students feel as safe as possible when they get back. We really wanted to make sure. That we gathered input on how the students were feeling about returning back, how the teachers were feeling about it. The scary incident revealed problems with consistent security at the school. Now, six security officers will be at the school, and then one for Huntington Middle that's housed in the same building. Staff also went through multiple safety trainings in preparation for the return. Executive Director of Secondary School Leadership, Dr. Felicia Barnett, says they'll also be increasing the use of metal detectors in different ways. Whether it be through our bus uh, scans using our uh, detection wands, also the use of metal detectors randomly coming inside of the building, as well as classroom searches and quick scans. So we have a variety of methods that we'll be using consistently, yet unannounced, so that students feel safe coming in the building. When students step back into the building, there will also be a team of counselors and social workers. Barnett says teachers have also set aside time for students to reflect. They'll also be able to experience some opportunity with morning meetings, opportunity to discuss, provide input on their needs, as well as give them some coping strategies to deal with returning back to the building after a traumatic event. Each student will also take home a mindfulness box full of resources. That'll include a list of calming apps students can download when they're feeling stressed or anxious. Heritage High School has set up a support hotline for students who want to call in. I'm told hundreds of students have taken advantage of that. And then as far as these safety increases, I'm told they will be implemented throughout the entire school year. In Newport News, I'm Aisha Tolliver. 10 on your side.